Hi, I'm Cal Van Doren, an application engineer here at AGI, and today I'm going to show you the Smart View utility within Operator's Toolbox. So Smart Views are uh, an expanded set of functionality upon stored views, which you might already be familiar with within the 3D graphics window. What Smart Views allow you to do is expand upon that to have preset views that will take you to a certain time in your scenario, a certain location, and allow you to turn on and off graphics for all kinds of different objects within your scenario. So you can turn on and off uh, graphics for individual parent objects, for sensors, uh, for transmitters, and on top of that, you can add in camera paths within your smart views. So you can set a view where, with just a simple click, you can configure your camera to the start of a camera path, turn on all the objects that you're interested in, turn off any objects that are cluttering up your scenario, even add data displays, and then quickly transition to that smart view and play forward. To demonstrate that, I have a scenario that was created for the Transporter 1 launch by one of our engineers here at AGI. And I have Operator's Toolbox open on the right-hand side. What I can do is I already have a few smart views already configured for this scenario. And if I just left-click over here on Smart View, and open up the smart view utility you can see i have four different smart views now each of these can be fully configured and if i hit edit the selected view this will show you all the options that you have when creating a smart view now all of these could be created by default by just using that green plus sign on the right hand side and since i already have all of these configured i'll just be able to show them off and uh, and show some of that functionality the first smart view here is the launch. Now, all I did was left click on smart view, hit launch, and we're already here at the start. And if I play forward, you can see we have a data display that shows up in the top left. And I'm already following a camera path. You can see that our camera is panning around the rocket as it's ascending. So this is just the first stage launch. Then if I want to go over to the second stage, I can just quickly click smart view and hit stage one drop and fairing separation. Now, if I play my animation forward, I can see our stage one drop, I can see our stage two engines kick on, and we have a new data display in the top left. Now our fairing has separated from transporter one, and we can move on to the next smart view, which is our stage two view. Now we're looking from high above and watching as Eglin Air Force Base down there on the south coast tracks our transporter one. You can see here that we now have a data display with our classical orbital elements, all pre-configured by our smart views. And finally, we have our deploy for our Transporter 1 satellites. If I change that smart view and hit play forward, we can watch as each individual satellite is deployed from Transporter 1. So using these smart views, I've been able to convey a lot of information about many different portions of this mission in a very, very quick and succinct way. So that's the power of smart views is you can pre-configure all of the different uh, Im important times and locations within your mission. And then you can quickly use these views to change between them and portray your story of your mission um, with, with great ease and simplicity. Here we can see that uh, each of the satellites that Transporter 1 has deployed is now being tracked by ground stations. And as we come up over the horizon, we're going to lose access to this previous ground station. So I encourage you to think about how you can use smart views in your scenarios, uh, not just as a, as a graphical tool, but also as a way of uh, finding new ways to, to talk about your scenarios and to portray the information that uh, you have uncovered from your analysis. So as always, thank you very much, and please don't hesitate to get in touch with us at support at agi.com with any questions.